Up undoubtedly has one of the most heart-wrenching, ballsy and flat-out emotionally destructive openings of any film I have ever seen. The unashamed realism of the simple but sincere first three minute love story are simply incredible. And even more so when you realise there wasn't a single word spoken throughout. Hi guys, I'm Nick, and in a short video today I basically want to have a look at some of the symbolism and storytelling in Up's married life. Firstly, let's have a look at the colour in the scene. One of Up's most important visual aspects is in its colour, and this scene is a shining example of this. As the scene begins, the colour palette is stunning and vibrant. Colours pop and contrast and look vivid and young. These first parts of the scene even have a dreamlike haze over them, like a fond memory. However, as the marriage progresses, so do the colours. Not fizzling out, but mellowing, calming down, and losing their vibrancy and more of their youth. Becoming more aged and comfortable, aging alongside our lovebirds. The colours muting and losing their sheen, but gaining a warmth with Carl and Ellie. Up's filmmakers using colour to show the progression of time and the genuine sweetness of the growth of these two characters' relationship. Until the colour is completely drained from the scene, as we all are from tears. Ellie's death taking the colour from the world, leaving Carl on his own. Where Carl, as Ellie does, loses his life. And the only colour left is in the blue balloon he carries home, and her spirit that he holds onto within it. Now, if that wasn't too poetic and sad enough for you, let's move on to the symbolism of the montage. It's subtle, but we can make out at the beginning of the story, our two lovebirds set out at dawn to renovate their new home. The sun streaming down on them, symbolising the beginning of their adventure. The sky is blue and young and flowers blossom around our lovers. However, as we move through the montage, the time changes from dawn to midday and full spring. This is a symbol of life and birth, a baby's on the way. However, Up doesn't pull its punches and the movie then immediately takes us away in a cut to a sterile room. From here, the season now switches to a careful eye, to autumn. The life has left in a way and the leaves falling and even Ellie's dress reflects them. Their relationship is mellowing and they're beginning to lose its youth. Then, in one of the saddest moments throughout this emotionally destructive scene, as Ellie climbs up the hill, she falls. The sun here has begun to set, the leaves on the tree are falling, and Carl waits alone at the top of the hill. Compare this to the beginning, where it was Carl who couldn't keep up with her boundless energy in the beautiful spring sun. Now it is Ellie who can't keep up in the sun's departure. The marriage here is symbolised so poetically, is coming to an end. And so in five short minutes, without a single spoken word, up through everything movies have to offer, crafts one of the most emotional scenes in my memory. And just so this doesn't end on a downer, it also sets up beautifully for when the colour will return, and Carl will go on his next great adventure.